மதிப்பிற்குரியவர்களுக்கும் வணக்கம் ராஜ்பவனுக்கும் இன்று ஒரு வரலாற்று நாள் பிகாஸ் இட் இஸ் ஹிஸ்டாரிக் பிகாஸ் திஸ் ஹால் தர்பார் ஹால் ஹேஸ் ஹெல்ட் மெனி இவெண்ட்ஸ் ஃபெலிசிட்டேட்டட் many dignitaries many achievers but today is a special a special because we have here all of you present here you are in your own ways silently bringing about a revolution revolution to transform this country you are all builder of the nation and to have all of you here i think raj bhavan feels blessed to have you all it is 100th episode today of prime minister man ki baat in the last 100 episodes think of how it has transformed and how it is transforming the country the first of all the one special unique thing about this entire series of man ki baat is nowhere ever any politics was in it normally normally today politics has so much become so overwhelming that whenever we think of a politician whenever we think of a political leader always think of politics sleeping waking whatever is speak there is politics but this 100 episode never ever he talked politics what did he do he connected with the people and started talking about common people unknown unsung people those who are doing incredible things in their own field wherever they are many of you are here present today and when prime minister mentions and you know he has named more than 700 persons and more than 300 entities ngos organizations these are samples in our country he touched every state and i think if you go by the number of references that he has made tamil nadu he mentioned perhaps the maximum <laughs> many a times by listening to his man ki baat and when he makes a reference to tamil nadu many of us here of course i am very new not that new but yes you know relatively many of us are getting to know about our people through prime minister modi <laughs> now this this is a very unique experiment and a successful experiment you know a country a country of 
130 crore plus as the prediction goes that by this year we will be the country with the largest population in the world we will overtake china <laughs> now such a country it cannot grow it cannot be built by the government or government alone government has limited capacity in fact before the idea of modern state came samaj the society used to look after itself kings had very limited role to play it was the society the people who looked after themselves unfortunately with the coming of modern state we all developed a tendency to look up to government for everything in the process the strength of the society the strength of the people people started forgetting and a dependency syndrome developed dependency government is not doing this government is not doing that government must do that now any government whichever government whichever party however well meaning government has huge limitation the country can be built if the people of the country they wake up they you know imagine the strength the potential we have amidst us so many of you and some of you came and shared your experience take the case of this little girl prasiddhi now she is hardly 10 years <laughs> imagine 1 lakh trees now 1 lakh is not a small number it's a it it shows the resolve first a cause cause a larger cause to save this planet earth mother earth we know what kind of problem we are all going to face the world is going to face and we also know that how it can be addressed but somebody has to take forward a step forward now this little girl took the initiative to plant trees and she has crossed 1 lakh now this is a remarkable work now take the case of vaikom vijay lakshmi visually impaired normally she would have been considered as a liability what pity object of pity now she challenged and she developed excellence in handling rare instruments rare musical instruments and she proved to the world that this is this challenge the disability cannot defeat me and it is a great inspiration to all that yes she has done it we can also do it take the case of karan dwarkesh in siachin i don't know how many of you have i'm sure many of you would not have been there i had the good fortune to be there in the course of my duty you know at that height you have to you have to experience you have to be there and experience to know what it means taking one step is an effort one a step because oxygen is so less that you we you and i sitting here we can't imagine shrest bharat ore bharatam unnat bharatam i thank this our friend anna durai and his team doordarshan all india radio 
Sudarshan ji who has been <laughs> comparing many people identify him with Prime Minister Modi. <laughs> you know, the way he... I mean, I have yet to see a, a person who is equal to him in translating. Equal not only in language, the way he modulates his body language altogether. <laughs> thank you very much. And thank you for... And thank you for making anchoring the event today. Thank you very much. Friends, I wish all of you all the very best. And I must say that this today we have a time constraint. We have we had an event and I did not spend time and I I really I am I regret that. But I assure you that in coming weeks and months I will be individually calling each one of you inviting to spend more time with you because I need to learn more from you. It is, it is just not... Today we have celebrated the event, 100th episode of Monkey Baat. But our engagement, our interaction remains incomplete. We will do it in coming weeks, coming months. One by one, one group by one group, one individual by one individual will call. And we will spend time. Thank you very much. Wish you all the very best. Jai Hind.